Hey guys, Crystal here at Crystal's Crafties. Um, I got a request the other day to make a video to show how I get this quick menu over here. So you guys see me use these a lot. I switch. I've got my align and distribute. I've got my fill and stroke menu. And I use these a lot. Um, and they're not always visible to you guys. So let me show you exactly how I get these. Okay, so when you open your Inkscape, you might have just a plain box or you might have something else over here and you're not really sure what it is. But there are three things that I use a lot when I'm editing my designs and I like to keep them right over here on the right so they're quick and easy. And the way you get them is super simple. All you have to do is come up here to the menu or the function that you want. Like this is my align and distribute. If I click it, it automatically appears over here on my right. I use more than just this though. I also use this fill and stroke menu a lot. So I click it and it got added over here to my right. And the other one I use a lot is when I export things to PNG image and that's not, that's not up here in any of these menus. That's over here in file and export PNG image. And then you'll see that pulled up over here too. So from here, I can just click these tabs up here and easily move back and forth between whatever it is I need to do. And let's say I don't want something. It's up there, but I don't want it to be there. Like maybe I don't want this export to PNG. There's a little X beside it. You just close it and it leaves your menu. And that's it. You can make this bigger. You can drag it out. Um, that is the smallest that you can make it. The more things you um, add up here, the more functionality you're going to have over on your right but let's say this looks too cluttered for you and you've put it here but you changed your mind and you don't want it you just click it all out and it all goes away and you have your full open screen and that's all there is to it thanks guys